This is ridiculous. Like, okay. I already saw this, so I know everything is happening, but I just, like, she's spitting the chips back in the bag. Now look what she brought with her. A plastic sealer. All right, so here she goes. She's sealing the bag with this plastic sealer. This is 26-year-old Alexandria Crest Boris. She was gunned down in a Kroger parking lot in South Carolina by 23-year-old Christina Harrison. It said that the two had an argument and Boris spit in her face and then turned around. At this time, Harrison put a gun to the back of her head and blew her brains out in front of her children. Now, I have always said that you cannot gauge a person's reaction we have words with people all the time. You are spitting in someone's face. You cannot gauge what their reaction is going to be. A lot of people are going to feel like this was an overreaction. And I won't say that I agree or disagree. But I will be consistent in saying that you cannot gauge a person's reaction. Coronavirus, you are Karen. Back away. <laughs> She's spitting my face. You I saw that. I got you on camera. I got you on camera. I, did not I got you. You did. I got you. You're a bitch. Don't touch my face. face. You scared in my face. Six feet away. Call the cops. I got it on camera. What is going on up in here? So today's video will be an interesting one. So we have a woman celebrating her birthday, and oh my goodness, she got spit on. Let's roll the footage. This video is from a TikToker who shared her experience of having to confront a Karen who spit on her while she was trying to celebrate her birthday. I'm not allowed to eat here. Don't. I'm checking out. I'm a slap her ass. Yeah, I'm. I'm <laughs> Get out of here. I am. I don't care. Can't put her out of here. Come on. Oh, bitch. Oh, bitch. Oh, bitch. Oh, bitch. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Bitch. Fuck with you, I'm girl. Sorry. No, fuck I'm you. Sorry. Spit on me again, bitch. Okay, Stupid ass, ass hoe. Okay. Okay. I'm sorry. My ass out here, guys. Fuck You know what? Honestly, I'm just surprised he let her go so quickly. I'm uh, I'm actually surprised. The thing about it is, I'm honestly of the mindset that speeding on somebody is probably, if it's not the most, is one of the most disrespectful things that anybody can do to you. Spit on you? You mean to tell? Look, 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 look. I'm just surprised she didn't. Edit her off. I'm glad she didn't. I'm just throwing a joke in there, guys. Just throwing a joke. The thing about it is, though, when somebody does something to somebody, right? You have a situation like this, you don't know what that person is going through. So if she would have went crazy, I'm glad she didn't. She was actually able to hold her composure as best she could. And I give her props for that. You cannot control what somebody else is feeling if if you had the audacity to spit on somebody and they just so happen to take you out of here i'm just saying you don't know what people are going through these days man spitting on somebody bro you mean to tell all that stuff that woman who knows that woman he brushed her teeth that more i'm just saying it does it wouldn't have made a difference but <sighs> well all that being said man like i said earlier with that being said like i said earlier like I said earlier, you can't gauge people's reactions just like you saw in the beginning of this clip. Somebody died, they spit in somebody's face, and then they died. So, I mean, I hate that she died, but you can't know, like, you can't expect somebody to just be okay with disrespect. And expecting a different outcome, I mean, you know, was it extreme? Yes. And both of them took a calculated risk. And we have somebody whose life is over because they killed somebody, and we have somebody else's life is over because they decide to spit on somebody. Just, just, you know, these situations can be avoided, man. These situations can be avoided. First clip that I showed you, like eating the chips and putting them back in. You know what that reminds me of? That reminds me, you know, you had that, the ice cream scandal was people were taking the ice cream off and licking it. That's just nasty, man. These people, I hope, I don't know what happened to her. I can't find an update. Let me know if y'all found the update or know the story already. 
But people like that, man, they deserve to be thrown under the motherfucking jail. I don't give a damn. I don't know what you got. I don't want your... Oh, that's just nasty, man. That's nasty. What will make you do that? I don't know. Let me know what y'all think about all this stuff down below. I'll see y'all in the next video.